Hi friends, this is Aparna and welcome to Aparna's Magic. Today I am going to show you how to make Gobi Roast my style. So let's get started. For that we need cauliflower or gobi. We are going to take around 400 grams of cauliflower or gobi. This is onion paste or pyaas ki paste, 1 cup. This is boiled peas or boiled mutter. This is adraki paste, that means ginger paste. This is Kashmiri red chili powder. This is cumin powder or jeera powder. This is dhania powder or coriander powder. This is milk or dood. This is elaichi and, and uh, this is lavang, that means long. And this is dal chili, that means cinnamon sticks. This is fresh cream, this is yogurt or dahi, this is kaju paste or cashew nut paste, this is garam masala powder and this is ghee. Our oil is nicely heated up, so we will fry the cauliflower or kobe into it. Let them fry for a while. They are nicely fried, so we will take them out. Now in the same oil, put 1 teaspoon of ghee. Let it melt. Add elachi or cardamom. This is lavang, that means clove or long. And this is cinnamon sticks that means dal chili. Now add 1 tablespoon of this is adrak ki paste that means ginger paste. Now add the onion paste into it or pyaas ki paste. Mix it. Now add 1 tablespoon of Kashmiri red chilli powder, 1 tablespoon of this is jeera powder or cumin powder, 1 tablespoon of dhania powder or coriander powder, salt to taste and sugar to balance it. Now mix them all. Let it cook for a while. Our gravy is simmering for 5 minutes now. So in this stage we will put 2 tablespoon of yogurt or dahi into it. Mix it nicely. Now add half a cup of this is kaju paste or cashew nut paste into it. Again, mix it. Look at the beautiful creamy color. Now add this is boiled peas or oblego in butter. Add half cup of milk or dood. Now add the fried gobi. Very careful. Let them cook for a while. Our gobi is simmering for 10 to 12 minutes now, so it is almost done. So, in this stage, we will put 1 teaspoon of this is garam masala powder, some 
fresh cream and one teaspoon of ghee. Now mix it gently, very carefully. Stay tuned for more recipes and please subscribe my channel.